Okay, I thought I'd show you uh, TrackMan and how TrackMan can help you with your goal swim. Now, TrackMan, you've probably heard of it if you fellow professional golf because it's the most widely used launch monitor in the world. Now, it's used on the PGA Tours massively, uh, but it's also used at amateur level, elite amateur level, junior level, and it's used massively throughout the coaching industry. Now, the reason why coaches would use this and the reason why I've bought one of these units is that it allows me to measure very accurately what the club head is doing throughout the impact zone. So in this particular swing, and I've chosen this swing here because it's pretty familiar to a lot of people, you can see that ball flight. The ball starts well left and is trying to curl back towards the target. So it's a sort of fadey slice type swing. Now, if we look at this golf swing, that's a pretty familiar look for a lot of people, isn't it? Really cutting across the golf ball. Now, the numbers. What do these mean? This one here, the club path, is what I'm going to focus on today. Now, club path is literally the direction the club head is moving at the moment of contact with the golf ball. It's either a negative number, which means the club is cutting across to the left, like this one. If we have a look at this, so very definitely cutting across the target line. A positive number would mean swinging out to the right, which I'll show you in a moment. 0.0, .0 would be straight down the target line. Now, just to give you an idea, I haven't had anyone yet who can consistently get 0.0. .0. Everyone's going to have a bias one way or the other. And so much of my job is to try and neutralize that path as much as possible and or make it as consistent as we possibly can. So we've got that one there, 11.7 to the left. Note the attack angle is four degrees down on the golf ball. Negative means down. Launch angle is 13.9. Let's have a look at something which is basically the opposite. So look, check out the golf shot. So to push out to the right, and the club path is 7.7 .7 positive, meaning it's 7.7 .7 to the right. You see that difference there. So very much a pushing action going out to the right. Attack angle is 0.5, launch angle 17. Now let's put these side by side, shall we? So let's look at this. We've got basically two opposite golf swings going on. 7.7 .7 to the right versus 11.7 .7 to the left. And just check these out side by side. A little bit different at the top. Massively different on the way down, aren't they? Massively different. So look at the difference in the release past the ball as well. Isn't that amazing? So where this machine helps me to help you is that I can really accurately measure what that club's doing through impact. So there's no such thing as guessing anymore in the coaching game, or at least there shouldn't be. I can tell you exactly what your path is, exactly what your club face is, exactly what your attack angle is, exactly launch angle, total distance, all that stuff. And from there, we can start to devise a plan to improve your goal swing, to improve these numbers and get those shots going better.